Hello guys, welcome back. Where we last left off, this one Russian fleet somehow managed to sink my entire economy. So I need to get the ball rolling on my economy again. I've done it before, but it's never been this bad. I didn't think that this one port was my lifeline. But apparently it is, so... Yeah. Uh, I did reduce it in, in the last part, so it's like half as bad now. But, uh, what I found out, just off camera, is that... Oh, I'm not taxing uh, Cuba here. Or Jamaica. There. Come on. There we go. Is that I can tax the nobility uh, here as well. I thought it was all one whole taxation, but apparently um, it's different for every region or theater. So if I go to India, do that, and it's not that much. It's still pretty damn bad. I hope it. I hoped it would uh, swap to a different port all my trade, but no, it's probably not going to happen. So I'm gonna have to reduce the garrisons in some of these places. Like here. Got tons of troops, don't need them. So line, line, line. Militia, get rid. And you. Okay, here. Don't need you. London, definitely do not need all of you. Only 77. Wow, that was some pretty damn uh, quick cleanup there. Wow, I have just been really inefficient, inefficient here. I did not know my empire was this bad. They just had troops lying around. From leftover invasions. Well, yeah, I'm offing up. I really did need to do this. In a way... Russia saved my economy because I was spending so much on just uh, trying to um, keep things going on my armies. I didn't know I had like I could make. What I'm trying to say is I had so much troops just lying around it was killing my economy anyway. So that Russian fleet blockaded me it was kind of a wake-up call. Now I want to keep the armies on the frontiers so. I'll leave that how it is. And I don't think there was much of a military presence in Africa. But what about in Spain? That was always a cause of problems there. But they, uh, they seem to be fine now. So I'll disband some of them. Portugal. Uh, just disband the Grandiers. Okay, so how's that looking? Yep, we're in the positives. And when the Russian fleet goes, I'm actually going to be having... Well, I'm going to have a lot more money. I've also got all these here. But I want to keep these guys here in case uh, the Marathans invade. Just in case. Anyway, now that i fixed my economy, next turn. Yeah, this isn't after the turns, guys. I decided to load back and see what happens if I let the... American Rebels win, but no, they just joined the United States, there's no monarchy or anything. So, with that mystery solved, I'll see you after the real next turn. Okay, so I've got an agent, a strike, works right, works right, left man, strike, yeah. And I've got an economy back, so, could be worse. So, move my uh, fleet there. Traits, recruitment, natural death. So, yeah, that trade's not going to move, and I have no way to uproot the Russians there. Uh, bonds I charge over here. At least this will free up a bit of my economy, a bit of my economy. Defeats. Uh. Yeah, just burn it. Disaster. 
Not really. I may have hurt them. I have no idea. Wait, who? I thought it said Napo uh, Napoleon Bonaparte. I was like, what? Did I just kill Napoleon Bonaparte? Uh, but no. Although, uh, history's already changed, so I doubt it would have mattered. Okay, so who hates me? Okay, so taking out troops from France did actually ruin everything. So I'm going to have to send some reinforcements over from here. Before France uh, rebels. Oh, damn. They was one of the people rioting, wasn't there? Well, wasn't they? Uh, go! That's why! That's destroyed our parrot! I will! Put two men in there. That's not good enough! I don't want to take them off tax. They're, they earn too much money for me. Really? Do I have to empty out the garrison of Brussels? Oh, now you're just being unreasonable. Fine. It's... I'm gonna have to do that. You too. You destroyed your happiness building, and now you want me to take you off tax. Is that it? I can't afford to take men out there. Maybe here. Move there. Minus one. Yeah, how much money? You know what? I'm already taking a big hit. 600 won't matter. So... Where's my men? You guys have to make Russia die. Quickly. I'm still waiting on uh, Moscow to fall. And of course we're still bobbed down here. Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna have to go through another round of cuts. I mean, these places should be fine now. Hopefully. Like, Corland has got lots of troops. And you're fine, so... I'll take out two. Maybe one more. That'll be fine. Over here, uh... Yes, yeah, so this video was just... Trying to make sure my empire doesn't fall apart. In my hands. Because it's that bad. I'm the Corsi of Rome! I've gotta make sure it lives! I... Gave birth to the new Roman Empire. And I am not gonna lose it now! Okay, we're breaking even there. I am going to have to reduce the garrison of somewhere. You. One... Man. There, I'm making money. I am back there after I've just taken a massive hit from not taxing France and, uh, Saxony here. Can I, uh... No. No, I can't. Oh, really? You as well? And Central Italy. You know, you take out one unit and they just... They go bonkers. You're fine, aren't you? Yeah, Tripoli's fine. Send reinforcements to the capital of Africa. This place is fine, right? Algiers is also fine. Malta? Yeah, you're happy. Not making me much money, though, are you? Like, your agriculture is the only thing you have. And you're not doing anything with it. I'll take it, uh, that down. Yeah, this is going terrible. I was going... It was going so well. And... Just... 
one fin hits me and it's all over. Well, I think that's in this part, folks. Didn't get through much, but uh, hopefully my empire won't collapse. It's all the provinces that make me money that I have to take a hit from. And now I'm down to negatives. But I should be able to take that hit. I cannot take uh, Rome off tax. I just can't. So, how much? How many people are in Rome? Wow, that's... Is that 36 million? Not bad. That is a really overpopulated place. Like, Rome should be out here. Probably not, but damn! That's what I mean by capital of the world. Uh, it's not grown anymore, though. Probably for the best. What's this? Bankruptcy. Well, isn't that a paradox? Anyway, thanks for watching, folks. And uh, I'll see you in the next part where hopefully more things get done. See you then.